concave back plate for the coil to really do its stuff. Yeah. Welcome back, boys. This, ladies and gentlemen, is the Beast Soundcube HDS312. By all means, not a slouch. I have the 12 inch model in front of me. They come in a 10 inch, a 12 inch, and a 15 inch. These things are 1200 watts RMS, 2400 watts peak. They come with a three inch voice coil, a dual two and a dual 4.0 model and all of the sizes, the 10s, the 12s, the 15s. We get this custom cast aluminum frame. We get 10 gauge push terminals here, positive, or I'm sorry, positive, negative. We get the sound cube logo right in the middle of the dust cap, which honestly, this is probably one of, one of my favorite logos. <sighs> On the back of the motor here, we can see that we get a vented back plate and that allows for optimal cooling and less turbulence in the coil gap. Oh yeah, this little raised part, it's like a raised back plate to allow the voice coil to travel much more deep. Not gonna lie, this thing's a little bit difficult to keep throwing around and showing you everything, but it has a 160 ounce motor. We get a soft three piece bolted spider pack actually, which uh, I didn't know it was bolted, but yeah, the spider pack is bolted to the cast aluminum frame. Failure at that part, zero issues ever. The recommended ported enclosure volume is one to 1.75 cubic feet. There you have it ladies and gentlemen, the lovely Soundcube HDS312. 1200 watts RMS, three inch voice coil, 10 gauge push terminals, optimized airflow design cooling basket, triple layer bolted spider pack, concave backplate for the coil to really do its stuff. And with that being said, I'm gonna go put you into my mattress.